translating the text that shows on the front part of SureCart that all your buyer sees is actually very easy and we're going to use a free plugin to do it. Now, if you don't follow these steps exactly as I show you, you might run into some trouble. So let's get started. In your store, you're going to want to go to plugins, click on add new. Over in the top right, we're going to search for a plugin named Loco Translate. And here it is. Now I've already gone ahead and downloaded this plugin. So I'm going to click right here where it says activate. And you can see here the new menu item for Loco Translate. So I'm going to click on it and I'm going to click right here where it says plugins. And I'm going to see a list of the plugins I have here. I'm going to click on SureCart. And I'm going to click here where it says new language. Now, I don't speak a foreign language, so I'm just going to choose English. And this will enable you to change any of the fixed strings of text on the front of the checkout forms and all of the different parts that your buyers will interact with. Now, here's the key. Where it says choose a location, it must be set to system. If you don't set it to system, it will miss a couple things here and there. And that's because some of the bits of text that are in a checkout form are inside of JavaScript. So if you don't have it set to system, you might run into trouble. And now if you've already gone through this process with Loco Translate before seeing this video and maybe a few text strings might be missing, just come in here and set it to system and then click on start translating to refresh all of the text strings that it will find. And so right here you can scroll through and you'll see all the different bits of text that a buyer might see on the front end of a checkout form. You can easily translate any of these simply by clicking on it. You'll see the source text right there. And then right here you can enter in what you want to replace it with. Now, from time to time, when we have a new release of SureCart that might add some new text strings to the front of SureCart, you'll have to come in here and click this button right here that says sync to resync with SureCart and pull out any new strings of text that haven't been translated yet. So let's test this to make sure it works. So here I have a checkout form. And I'm going to expand where it said show summary. And here is a word that says every month. So this is a monthly subscription and it says every month. So let's go and find this text string every month and change it. So instead of scrolling through this long list, I'm going to do a search right here where it says filter translations. And I'm going to tap, type in, well, there it is. I typed in the first two letters. Here's every month. So all I need to do is go here and enter in something different. I just entered in each month. So now with my one change made, you can see I have a little asterisk here. I have my translation there. I'm going to click right there where it says save. Now let's check to see if we got the right text string. Okay, I'll go ahead and refresh the checkout form and scroll down, expand the summary, and it still says every month, and that's probably because I didn't get the right text string. In this case, it's different, these two words, so we're not showing it together as a phrase. Let me show you. You can see right here is the word every on its own. So when I click on that, let me go ahead and translate that to the word each. And then I'm gonna go here and click on save. And now let's check on the front. I'll do a refresh. I'll scroll down, expand the show summary, and you can see that time I got it each month. And the reason it didn't show is because we have it separated into two separate different text strings. And so I was able to get it the second time. And that's all there is to making a translation. And so if you leave your site and come back, just click on local translate, loco translate, and then click here where it says share cart. Then click into the translation that we created and you're right back where you were. And you can see your progress in translating this. Uh, we're at one tenth of a percent on the way and you can continue translating.